Hi everybody, Candace here with Greener Farms DIY. And today I'm gonna to show you how to work one of these reed pleaters. This one's a little bit older model. Came with directions. Looks like it's made in South Africa. And uh, the model that the directions are printed for don't really match the model uh, that was in the box. But I read through the directions and from what I can tell, I think I know kind of how to use this pleater. So the first thing is you gotta thread the needle. And for that, they're very, very tiny. I'm using a little bit thicker thread, so it doesn't quite like probably a good foot of thread. I'm tying a little knot at the end of my thread. Um, the directions don't say to do that, but in my mind, that kind of makes sense to have something at the end. All right, so now I have everything threaded. And from what I can tell, it says to start your material from the back side. So what this does is it just makes a really nice uniform pleat um, for that really cute look that you're going for um, when you're doing old vintage work. And so you can tie a knot on this side. Um, get that nice and straight. Depending on how long you want your smocking, that is how you do it. Very simple. Um, I used a dark thread so you could see it, but naturally you could use a white thread with white fabric. Thanks for watching.